The state medical licensing board voted this afternoon to suspend Dr. Michael Cozy's license. News Channel 15's Angelica Robinson was there for the hearing. She continues our coverage from Indianapolis. Right now I'm inside the Indiana Government Center where that hearing took place. For about three hours, the board listened to arguments over whether or not Dr. Cozy should keep his license. In the end, they decided there were enough questionable accusations to investigate further. Several allegations against Dr. Cozy came to light earlier this week when the Indiana Attorney General filed a petition for an emergency suspension of his license. The Attorney General accused Cozy of prescribing more controlled substances than any other prescriber in Indiana. But that's not all. There were also concerns that he sexually abused and verbally abused his patients and employees. For the first time today, we've heard some of the disturbing testimony regarding Cozy's behavior in the office. Two federal investigators testified along with Dr. Cozy himself. An agent with the DEA says they sent an undercover patient into Cozy's office who witnessed some of his practices. She said he prescribed narcotics to the undercover agent who previously told him that he was treating his pain with alcohol. The agent also detailed the deaths of three patients under Cozy's care. An investigator with the Attorney General's office says Cozy's office was described as a land of Mountain Dew, nicotine, and despair. She said she received dozens of complaints of verbal and sexual abuse from patients and employees. Cozy reportedly asked for sexual favors and touched women inappropriately. He was described as a volatile person, constantly using profanity and racial slurs in the office. He's also accused of making threats to one person, saying if she reported him to the attorney general, he would make it, quote, real bad for her. Cozy denied all of this is true, and he said he's turned away more than 500 patients who exhibited drug-seeking behavior. Cozy said this whole investigation was started by a disgruntled former employee and patients trying to conduct a smear campaign against him. Now, Dr. Cozy is banned from practicing medicine for the next 90 days. His lawyer says after that time is up, they will file for his license again. Reporting in Indianapolis, Angelica Robinson, News Channel 15.